Hello, this is Jesse Cannon Wallace with Atlanta Classic Cars Mercedes Benz, and I am going to take you on a test drive in our 2017 E43 AMG. This is the AMG enhanced version of our current E Class. You can tell it's AMG ness from the uh, logo on the front. This has the 20 inch upgraded wheels, it has bi turbo badging on the side, and then its most obvious difference is the red. AMG logo here under the hood. 396 horsepower, 384 pound-feet of torque, and a bi-turbo V6. So let's take it for a spin. All right, I am my own camera person. So buckle up, straighten it out, we're going out on the road. So the E43 has the Alcantara grips on the steering wheel, flat bottom, AMG inspired, AMG logos, none of which are available on the E300 of course. This particular vehicle has a gorgeous trim that I hear is limited these days. joy of the AMG cars is just listening to how they sound. All the controls are basically the same as the other E-classes. The steering paddle, the shift paddles are a little bigger, aluminum up and down. You can see the gauge cluster here. I think you can see it. it has a couple of different displays that we can look at. And all of this is controlled by the touchpad on this side of the steering wheel. And all of this is controlled by the touchpad on this side of the steering wheel. So I can scroll through my radio and navigation systems right here. We will turn that down. Barrel control over here. You can also click that down to mute it, which is nice. Uh, the large screen up here is, of course, our command system. So we have navigation, radio, media interface, telephone controls, and our system settings. All of this can also be controlled here from my touchpad, which is so handy. So you never have to take your hands off the wheel. You can also control it from the touchpad down here. So if I want to control my menus. All right, we are turning, signaling. Eyes are down. Dynamic bolsters in my seat. I just got a little hug. I know you're jealous. I hope that sun is not too much. So I'm going to switch now my dynamic select mode. I'm in Sport Plus. I'm going to switch it to Comfort for easy cruising. speed transmission so it's very smooth you very rarely feel a downshift especially in comfort some of my 43 AMG customers have said that in Sport Plus in town it's a little bit too much shifting but if you switch it to comfort it's very smooth for in town driving this is a pretty bumpy road pretty rough it handles it really well I am going the speed limit unlike most others this car does, of course, have the blind spot monitor, lane tracking camera up here. This is not a premium three package car, so I do not have the Distronic or Drive Pilot system. I do have, of course, standard collision pre prevention assist, although I think we're calling it advanced brake assist these days. Uh, attention assist is working all the time, of course. So the car will not let me make any mistakes. cruise down Satellite Boulevard here. There's all the other car dealerships. You can't pull in in the E43 because everybody will come outside to look at it. I tried that earlier. So beautiful layout. You can't see it now but at night it's got 64 color ambient lighting here so you can really customize it and make it look like your own car. You've got the Burmester sound system, which is phenomenal. I have not yet had one with the high-end 3D, so I cannot vouch for it, although I'm sure it's wonderful. I'm going to turn here. Handles wonderfully. Again, dynamic select. I got a hug from my seat, or dyna dynamic multi-contour seat. Pardon me. 
And now the obvious real reason I'm out test driving. Time for some super fa. All right. Thanks for riding along on the E43. And I will see you again soon. This is Jesse with Atlanta Classic Cars Mercedes-Benz.